A new company has been chosen to operate the Sabino Canyon shuttle service. The regional partnering center says by July of 2019, they'll have a full fleet of electric vehicles. Now your side's Ivan Rodriguez spoke with TEP to learn more about their million dollar contribution to the future shuttle operator. Over the years, thousands of people have ridden the shuttles at Sabino Canyon, which are powered by diesel. Tucson Electric Power Communication Specialist Sherry Cadeau says the plan is to install all electric shuttles. We're all about promoting sustainability and clean energy efficiency. In total, TEP is contributing $2.5 million. $1.5 million will help the new operator, Regional Partnering Center, managed by the Pima Association of Governments, which coordinates regional planning, tackle startup costs. Another million dollar interest-free 10-year loan will also be provided. And this made perfect sense to combine the best of transportation access to the beautiful canyon and using electric vehicles to take visitors throughout the canyon. Cadeau says the funds come from corporate resources, not customers' rates. RPC will assume control July 1st after the old shuttle operation expires. The U.S. Foreign Service issued RPC a five-year permit. The new service in there and improved services that are being operated by the RPC, it'll be very popular. Their proposal certainly met all of the requirements that were laid out and specified by the Forest Service. And certainly they're hoping that with that five permit, it will be renewed. So we're hoping for a 10-year period. RPC will also be responsible for operations and maintenance of the shuttle system. Ivan Rodriguez, KGA 9, on your side.